throughout the last cycle of touring, you know, there'd been a number of days off where killing time, you know, Billy go into studio or we'd all go into studio and jam and it just felt like, uh, you know, the, the songs kind of just kept coming and we just got home after the last tour and really kind of went right back into it. We had all this abundance of songs and it just kept coming, kept coming and we were like, just not worry about what we're going to put it out on. So we just thought, like, what if we did like a three volume set of, of records and just threw them out at the same time? Almost like, like Van Halen 1, Van Halen 2, Van Halen 3 or something like that. But instead it's like, basically the records are called Green Day, but it, it's, we just went Uno, Dos, and Trey. <laughs> There was no conscious effort to, to write political songs or, or write personal songs. It just felt natural to start writing songs that are more, it could be sexual tension, it could be um, you know, living for the moment because you don't know what's going to happen tomorrow, um, uh, and then it could be sexual tension, it could be, <laughs> did I say sexual tension? You know, the, the whole process and the cycle is all about chaos. It's all about shooting from every single direction we possibly can. There's no format to what we do. There's no, there's no rules, and it's just a big breath of rock and roll fresh air, and it's a big fuck you to everybody at the same time. Yeah. 